I just made a video about EndeavorOS Mercury and we've tested the ATT. In a few hours, this virtual machine is gone. So I'd like to test something extra as well. We have other apps. Arch Linux 3 tool is the idea that it's working on anything Arch, right? Anything based on Arch. With the ATT, we've already installed our chat WM look a fork of DWM and we can do all kinds of things like var if it's <coughs> available right pseudo pacman minus s variety variety is um, a great tool as it provides wallpapers otherwise it's little tweety here which is okay but alt n is already programmed in there control alt o i'm killing pykem in virtual box here and I don't like Flickr, folder, oh, folder might be interesting. The fetched folder, sure. But this might be interesting because it will contain things probably, hopefully, also from um, the guys in DevOS. Okay, that's just wallpaper. That's not important at all. But nevertheless, um, we have to look at it all the time. So yeah, sure. Um, the thing is, I'd like to test other applications as well. One of them is AKM and AKM is the Arch Linux kernel manager. All right, what's that? Well, uh, let's first do an EOS update and check what we have. We've got the three repos on Arch Linux available because of the previous video, ATT. Yes, NeoFetch, All right? What, on what system are we? We're on Endeavor OS. With ATT, you can install any desktop. I chose ChatWM. What I'd like to do now is the AKM sudo pacman minus s arch linux and then tap tap. These are all arch linux things. The kernel manager is the one I'd like to install. But as you see, there's more. Arch linux logout is already installed. Tweak tool is already installed and some wallpapers. Okay, this is the one. This is an app developed by somebody else. AKM and here we go it's really a beauty of, a, of an application it actually reads from the internet and builds the app on the fly right I mean a lot of brain power to build something like that and we have a slider we can go all the way back right way back LTS Zen hardened RT, RT, LTS. If you open up Chaotic, for instance, you can add other stuff. That's, for example, CacheOS is there. The main line is there. Uh, what's the nom name again? Picorix or something. This, it sounds like a sweet, something to eat, right? So let's do a test, see if we can install the LTS, just to click away. Confirm, I want that, sure. Let's see if it works because basically we did not change anything, and this is not working with make init CPIO, this is working with Dracut, and this is what you see here Dracut, Dracut. Let's see if that works. All things happening. All right, kernel install complete. This window can now be closed. Okay, okay. Close, close. Quit, quit. And super X reboot R. Let's go to an E. This is E. Yep, we see fourth line at the bottom loading Linux, Linux, Linux LTS. You see it? So that's cool. And if you want to go back to the other one, that's here. But we want to go and have a look. Is this booting up? Is this working? Can we advise people to install Arch Linux kernel manager on anything Arch Linux based? Well, we tested it on Endeavor OS. So let's log in. This is LightM, the Slick Reader, and new fetch. We're on 6, 12, 13, 
and then I should be 14 this last one right 6 12 13 1 LTS everything is working fine well you should test it of course a bit longer but everybody everything should be fine um, that's the ACAM okay ACAM is working Arch Linux kernel manager sure something else we have is we have fun at building ISOs and yes it can be a little bit technical but no it is not if you use the Arch Linux application Galate dev this one right not the development but this one Dev stands for development, Nemesis stands for development. Now, if all is well, the code moves, right? AG is another application, Ctrl Alt O, <laughs> killing PyCam. Virtual machine, not so good. It's a pity that these things are not aligned. So, if there's somebody who has more knowledge than me, it has to do probably with, yeah. It looked great in Arch Linux, but when we move it somewhere else, even though we think all the fonts and everything is available, something is wrong with it. So if somebody knows why we can't align this here and we can align it in Arch Linux, great. This is a tool where we build ISOs and this is just a click of the button. So every month we release ISOs, right? but mid-month, 1502 any day every second of the, of the month you can say let's create a new Arconet let's create a new Arco Pro let's create a new Arco Plasma and for all the rest as well create your personal Arch Linux ISO exactly the same thing nothing altered archlinux.org that one but not the first of the month halfway so the new kernel is in same for the personal Ariser ISO. Have a look at the website, what it is all about. All about Ariser, Sierra. And Arco install is the latest delivery system of our Arco ecosystem. So with Arco install is basically an Arch Linux ISO on which we change a few things and we can select all, all the desktops that we have and install them, right? So let's just Test one of them. If one of them works, all of them will work because it's all the same procedure. And yes, we're building the ISO, right? We can stop it here. Do one more test, for instance, in this one. And off it goes. Downloading all kinds of packages in order to build an ISO. And with this ISO, you put it on a USB. Simple as that. You put it on a USB, eraser out, something will come in here right we stop the process but there will be an iso in there you burn it with what we call linux mint stick so the mint stick application it's a beautiful thing works great mint stick right number two mint stick kit arconix repo third party i'm not gonna build it i'm gonna install it super fast so much easier than actually gonna go through the building process. All you need is drag the ISO, which is in here. Here is an ISO, drag it to here, pop in a USB stick, select it, right, done. How easy can it be, right? And it's from Linux Mint itself. So that's working as well. The logout, you've seen that, that's this. That's the Arch Linux logout. The welcome app is not that important. There is a welcome app and it's called EOS Welcome, right? Stick to it. That's your welcome app. And um, don't show anymore. Voila, I remember. Um, that's it, I guess. Testing out those guys. Let me see. Right when I paused it, I said, yes, of course, we forget one. I was thinking about Sophie Rem. Sophie Rem is on the AOR. Aha. But yes, take hours. We have um, the Arcanlinx repos available. And there we go. Sophie, nice name. Sophie can be launched like this. 
Unlike in other videos, I often launch it like this, but you can of course launch it from here. So if you ram, find a menu and go for it. So when we install Linux, we use Calamaris. When you use Calamaris, we say you can install more and all the things you need and want, you select it. But afterwards, there is no Calamaris anymore. So software is basically the translation. What if you forgot something during the installation and you forgot to install Discord? Click. Discord will now be installed. And that's as simple as that, right? There is more to it. The three, three points up here are interesting. Maybe display package version, right? If you want to see that. By default, we've put it off. Set off a little bit too busy, too crowded. But there's more. Hmm? Article Linux key ring, on and off. Mirror list, on and off. Log file, you can import a list of packages. They say, okay, let's import a series of packages that I've painstakingly selected. And then say, okay, let's import it again. Export, import. Uh, show install packages. You export what you have on this machine and later on you import it. So things like that, ideas that we had and file managers that you can like or don't like fastest terminal file manager i have no clue what this was what this is how this did it look <laughs> we add packages and then right it's up to you to see what you do there's not a lot in here of course there's no packages in here let's go up here etc for example pacman.com what happens if i type no idea right page down that works Page down, Pacman, 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 this one, Pacman.com, and it opens that up. Right. So many tools in Linux, and so little time. But here's SophieRAM. SophieRAM is there for you as well. I think we've got them all now ATT, AKM, AAG, and Sophie. And the Arch Linux logout, and the Arch Linux welcome, but that's more for us an Arch Linux welcome. All right, that's it for me. Test is done. Uh, all our apps are working on Endeavor OS. That's what I wanted to know. I have 12 minutes in the video. Maybe you see me install Variety. That's one reason why Variety is not working. Maybe you want to see that as well. So sudo pacman minus s Arcolix Variety. In order to make variety work on all 30-ish desktops, we've done something. ETC, 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 scale, where are you? There he is. Control H, config, variety, control C, eric.config, control V, replace, 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 okay, replace. Now we launch variety, Alt N, okay, Alt N, Alt N, oh, it's working, sure, All right. Tip of the day, wallpaper selector, you can select like this, but super tip of the day, preferences. Stop using your own, grab them from wallhaven.ce, and we're into sci-fi right choose a tag sci-fi okay and wait for it first second oh that's cool let's go for this one <laughs> all right the artists at their best also nice and be amazed, right? Sometimes people, well, not sometimes, many times a month, people say, give me that wallpaper, give me that wallpaper. No, no, do what I do. Wallhaven, your tag, get stuff in, enjoy. All right, 
Have fun with Endeavor OS. Cheers.